In this video tutorial, we are going to demonstrate how to use and show the different functions of the temperature indicator on site models of Isotec dry blocks. The temperature indicator. Site models include an electronic temperature indicator. The indicator can be configured for the desired sense type and for custom calibration data. The custom calibration data can be set on or off. Setting the input type. A 100 ohm resistance thermometer can be connected to the PRT connector or a thermocouple may be connected to the miniature thermocouple connector. Ensure that only a PRT or thermocouple are connected at any one time. If a PRT and thermocouple are connected simultaneously, the indicator will read in error. Check that any sensor placed into the equipment is suitable for the temperature range. Sensors can be damaged if taken outside of their normal operating limits. The desired sense type is easily set. Simply press the scroll key until the lower display indicates in type. The upper display will now show the current set sensor type. The indicator allows you to choose between a range of resistance thermometers and thermocouples. This is done by pressing the up and down keys. Enabling and disabling custom calibration. Custom calibration allows the indicator to be programmed to suit a particular temperature sensor. This allows the indicator to automatically show the true temperature without having to manually apply a correction. When the custom or user calibration is active, the indicator will show the REM beacon lit continuously. The use of user calibration can make a significant difference to the accuracy of the instrument, and this REM beacon provides a clear and continuous indication of the calibration status. IceTech will configure and set user calibration when the dry block is ordered with a particular temperature sensor. To alter the calibration status, Press the scroll key until the lower display shows UCAL. The upper display will indicate either ON for user calibration or OFF for factory calibration. Use the up and down keys to toggle between the two values. When calibrating an unknown sensor against a calibrated probe, it may be necessary to switch the calibration OFF for the unknown and ON for the calibrated probe. Instrument address. Like the controller, the indicator has a configurable address, which is used for PC communications. Each instrument has an address. This allows several instruments to be connected in parallel on the same communications bus. The default value is 2. The controller defaults to 1. This address would only need to be changed if more than one dry block is connected to the same PC port. To check the address value, Press the scroll key until the lower display indicates ADDR. The upper display will show the current value, which can be modified with the up and down keys. Units. Press the scroll key until the display reads Units. Now, using the up and down keys, you can choose between degrees Celsius, degrees Fahrenheit, and finally, Kelvin. Advanced Indicator Operation The indicator can be configured with up to five custom calibration points. The points contain data pairs. First, the temperature point, and second, the error offset at that point. Isotec dry block calibration certificates will show the values to suit a particular sensor. These values can be inspected and modified with the following procedure. Hold the page key down until the upper display indicates CONF, go to, then zero code. Set the code to 2 using the up key. The display will then read CONF. Press the page key until the controller shows CAL. Now use the scroll key to examine the data pairs. The values point 1 through to point 5 an offset 1 through to offset 5 can be modified with the up and down keys. To exit this mode 
Hold the page key until the top display shows CONF go to. Then set the upper display to level 1 using the up key. While in this mode, take care not to modify any other parameters. The indicator will now restart and go back to displaying the temperature.